Where are your new iPads? You guys came here without them? Where's yours? I know you're a big fan of the iPads. I was expecting you to be. Do you think I'm going to wait out in the rain? My advanced years, where, when someone as young as yourself could be out there? Well, we do have people out there, I think, right? Waiting yeah, we, and we've reporting had people, on the lines. We've had people out there in, in Hong Kong, Paris, London, right, right. Uh, New York, and, and there's been lines. Although, interestingly, not as much in Hong Kong. Uh, we had a couple of stories today about how you actually can't go and buy, just walk into the store in Hong Kong and buy the iPad, because they've had such problems there before, so you have to buy it online and then they give you a time to uh, come get it. Okay, so avoiding the lines, that's positive, I yeah, would think. Yeah. I mean, look, you know, with Walmart, with people getting killed every year at Christmas, right, it's this probably, is probably <laughs> like the right way to go for all purchases yeah. like this. Right, right, right. I, I expect on Fifth Avenue, Manhattan, they're not storming the barricades. I don't know. People. I mean, do we have evidence that that's not happening? That's, that's <laughs> true. You never know. So, um, and what, what's new about this uh, this iPad, Julia? What's, what's special? Well, what's more special about this I mean, iPad? The thing the is, it's ones. faster, and the screen is supposed to be better, um, but it's not actually like that much <laughs> of a difference, right? right. Although it's, the nice it's thing, incremental change. Yes, it's, it's incremental. And look, every time Apple does this, people sort of say initially, "Oh, it doesn't seem as cool," and then they go buy it, and they're like, "It is really cool." There's like the same cycle well, that's what that happened happens with the 4S. With the 4S. It was sort of everyone right. came out went, "Oh, that's," and then they discovered Siri, and they said, "Wow, we love right. this." Right. So I think I think the same cycle might well happen with right. the iPad. The other Although, thing, if Apple is watching on Siri, can I just note that Siri <laughs> cannot understand a six-year-old, which can make <laughs> him very unhappy, <laughs> not good. Let's hope the new iPad can understand my six-year-old. Six but I think the pricing is an important point, which is that they keep the price at the same as the old, right? So right. it's like, basically, they're not trying to upsell you. They bring down the old one to a lower price, so it's a very good strategy, because you don't have to then buy into the idea that it's actually better. It's just the, it is the latest version at the same price. Right. And actually, in some cases, you can go get even the iPad 1, yes. which also gets bumped yes, down in right, price. Yes, right, which is starting to get to very reasonable prices. It, it's interesting, because the, the iPad 1, now Jeanette here, who's still a holdout, doesn't yeah, have one. Yeah, I was like, how low exactly is the price, and how much lower is it going to go? Because that's when I'm well, going to buy you, it. Oh, you're you can, not in at all yet. I'm not in at all. I don't have any iPad. I know. No, actually, no iPhone, no iPad, nothing. Do you I'm realize dead. they've wow. sold 55 million? Like, you are now starting to be in the minority. <laughs> I'm already minority. Oh, right. <laughs> I'm a stubborn one. That's, yeah. And, but the iPad one now is down about two hundred ninety nine dollars. So you're actually getting into the range of the Kindle Fire. Yeah. Um, it starts getting more competitive. That's for very reasonable. That's pocket I think I'll change. I'll wait for like two or three more years. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> so much for being an early adopter. <laughs> no, huh? not at all. Not at all. No. All right. Well, we will have a lot more about the iPad launch on WSJ.com, and you can see footage and pictures of the sales and people lining up around the world on WSJ.com.